Hi everyone. Throughout this tutorial, you'll learn to change the default port of the remote desktop access. By default, the port used is the 3389 and while it is active you don't need to specify it within your remote desktop program. However, it may constitute a security breach as it is a well-known port. By changing it, you would protect your VPS from 95% of the brute force threats. Here are the steps to proceed. Click on the Start menu and type Regedit in the search field as shown below. Once in the registry editor, you would need to click in the left part, on he underscore local underscore machines then system. Current control set. Control. Terminal server. Wind stations, RDP TCP. On the right part, you would need to right-click on port number and select Modify. In the pop-up that appeared you would need to tick decimal and change the value to the one you want. This value would define the port. The value shouldn't exceed 65,535. For instance, I changed to 3,650. We would now need to apply the change to the firewall to allow the connection to the new custom port. We would need to click on the Start menu and search Windows Firewall then click on Windows Firewall with Advanced Security. Now, we would need to click on Inbound Rules in the left sidebar. Then, you would need to click on New Rule on the right sidebar. In the window that appeared, we would need to tick Port and click Next. On the next screen, we would need to click on TCP and tick specific local port and finally enter the port you have chosen. Then you would need to select Allow the connection. Next, you would need to select Domain, Private and Public and hit Next. Finally, you would need to set the name of the rule and hit Finish. That's it. Upon restart, you will be able to connect to your VPS with the custom port you have chosen. To do so, in your remote desktop program you would need to type the following. For instance, if your custom port is 3650 and your Windows VPS IP address is 192.168.0.1, you would need to type. 